just going up to a pillbox. It's a bit out of the way, so hopefully we'll be able to get in it and have a look. Again, it's got the, uh, the mud on top. Let's cover it up. Again, we've got the mountains for the firearms. Camping. This must have been the deluxe pillbox. Yeah. Yeah. For the distinguished gentleman pillbox operator. Did they ever have females in these during the war? I don't know. I've no idea. Looks like this has been used more recently for bird watching. Mm. And something's got in here and eaten a cushion. Probably mice or rats. That's all the firm out of it, isn't it? Yeah. Out. They've cut this out so you can get the elevation to fire upwards because it is our belief that this area was heavily patrolled with uh, bunkers and HQs and things like that because this was earmarked as a possible invasion place from the SS. So they dropped the paratroopers in um, to take out the gun batteries, the C gun batteries, so that the ships could pull in to invade and then would have been Nazis everywhere then, wouldn't it, Dave? It would. We don't yeah. want that. Yeah, no, I don't want to swash stickers on my underpants. No. Certainly not. There's some of the remaining wood there. This is very unmolested, isn't it? So that's this pillbox explored. It's uh, in good condition that. So we're quite out the way, so these have been undamaged by the idiots, thankfully. We're just off to, there's two more for us to go see. So let's go find them. Just trying to get to that pillbox there. But we've got this in the way. Yeah. And I haven't got my waders. Yeah, I need to see because there's another one going down there, mate. Yeah, we might, yeah. Might be on the wrong side of the river here. The other one's further that way. But we've just got across this little dike. It's deeper than it looks, but straight into MOD fencing. And there's a pillbox just over there. So let's find what we can find. Spotted it. Yeah, there's one over there. But that's in good nick. I bet there's something in there, Dave. That's where that box is. You know, on Google, Google Earth, there's a square box in there. Oh, yeah. And there's a fence going to it. Oh. So it's in there. It's now submerged. A bunker. I don't know. It's a lot of fence posts, though, isn't there? It's is a lot of fence posts. Yeah. So I'll check this. Uh, 
down for you that. Yeah. Looks like the entrance to this one's actually fallen in the water. So we're not sure if we're going to get in this one. If we do, it'll be... If we can't, we'll do it with a GoPro. That is the entrance quarter, isn't it? It's fell in. Oh yeah. Here we go. Well, you can see how the, the land around here changes so much. Because the portal windows will be there. They're buried. There'll be one under there. Yeah, it's fell over sadly. Yeah, the windows are buried in that side. Gun post. Yeah, the mountains are still in. You can see where they've had uh, like a prefabricated box or something here. Yeah, and these are just buried with sand. This is slowly getting reclaimed by nature sand's filling it up just as the people haven't done this that's just the, the way the tide changes and moves the moves the earth around It's fallen off, I don't know, with the weather or the takes some pushing over. So I don't know if humans have done it. Subsided as the uh, the land. Yeah. It's fallen away. It's just how see this is why we're documenting all these, because one day this won't be here, it'll be gone forever. It's heading over to the next pillbox now. The sea is very powerful now, coming in. Very windy indeed. But here we have a World War II pillbox. Again, it's looking inland, isn't it? Oh no, sorry, it's this. this. Yeah, it's been looking out there, but all this, the, the tide's pushed mud back. The mountains still present. And again, the land's taking back the bunker. Like, uh, it feels to be on um, slant, does this? Is, uh, is a bit of subsidence going on? Yeah, I'd agree, yeah. Doesn't feel level, does it? No. I think it's that pontoon things you can see on Google Maps. Double check we can get back this way. Just seen a swan on its own in the field. I'm trying not to scare it. So uh, it knows we're here. I'm not trying to scare it where the other side of a big dike. Nice little swan there. I'm not expecting to find one of those. This is quite in a in an isolated place. There you are, it's amazing what you find when you go look here. Two more down there. In the uh, see in the dike. We 
Bro, I'm on a Dave shortcut, so we're in another day. Is it dried up? Hey! Cable. Fell off. So that clamps on the HV cables, and that acts as a balancer. No, this one is, is so aircraft can see it. But then, it's stuck and waggling about. You put it on your car aerial. Well, I hope you've enjoyed these explores. If you have, please like and subscribe. It really helps me out when you do that. I'm Andy. And I'm Dave. Thanks very much for watching. Bye-bye. Well, I hope you've enjoyed these explores. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this explore. I'm Andy. I'm Dave. Do that again.